In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. This is Father Angel Andres from the Mission of San Andrew Apostle in Tijuana, Baja California, Diocese of Mexico, of the Orthodox Church in America. The Gospel is for October the 22nd, 2019, according to St. Luke. And the Lord said to his disciples, Let your waists have been girded, and the lamps burning. And you should be like men waiting for the Lord of themselves, when he returned from the wedding feasts, in order that having come and having knocked, immediately they may open the door for him. Blessed are those slaves, whom having come the Lord of them, he finds them keeping watch. Truly I say to you, that he will dress himself and make to recline them, and having come beside, he will serve them. And if, if in the second, and if in the third watch, he comes and he finds them thus, blessed are those. Glory be to thee, O God, glory be to thee. Well, today I would like to stress the point that it is important that we be girded and also to have our lamps alight. What is that? The lamps alight is that we should ha have, first of all, awareness. But second, that we should strive to have the Holy Spirit burning within ourselves, always. And our loins girded means that we have to walk in holiness, but also that we must refrain from overeating or overdrinking. It is a beautiful tradition that we Orthodox priests get to dress ourselves and to gear ourselves with a, with a piece of of a uh, cloth called soul, which basically is like, um, how could I describe it? It is a piece of re a piece of uh, of the ornament that basically girds ourselves, and before we gird with it our loins, we pray, "Blessed is our Lord, who girds his priests." in righteousness for he has given me hinds feet and has placed me in high places in order for us to be before the altar of God we should be blameless and even though we are sinners just as you are we strive to respond to this grace of God continually and in the same way I invite you to be very careful not to get to get drowned drowned down by the devils that truly enjoy the pleasure sensations of the flesh that is why gluttony drunkardness and sexual abuse and the like are the result of satanic oppression and sometimes possession and we have to fight against it how? By praying constantly in the morning, in the midday, in the night, and also by fasting. We should fast every Wednesday and Friday and abstain from red meat, or from meat rather, any kind of meat on those days. That we might be able to remain and become blessed as the Lord is telling us today. May He shine His face on each one of you and take you in his hand. For blessed is our God always, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen.